for human rights together with Cindy Lauper and the Ratio. How much are you involved in the, this fight against AIDS and HIV and how will you support it yeah, as an uh, artist? Well, I was part of the MAC campaign uh, previously uh, last year so um, I'm very involved in it. I've always supported it and I've always had a, uh, you know, it's been a very important thing in my life. Linda Evangelista, hi and welcome to the live ball. Thank you, thank you so much. This is so exciting. Yep. It's, oh my is God. it? Yes, I mean, I've heard about it, but you have to actually, it's so grand. The scale of it is absolutely amazing and the energy is, it's very, it's, it's overwhelming and wonderful. Take another chance, take a fall, take a shot for you. for the Chris Hope Award. Um, I thought um, it must be a very sentimental moment for you as well. Yes, I, I think it's really important to have fun and really support this cause as well and to bring all these wonderful fashion icons together and people from the music industry and the film world and television world. I think it puts a tremendous amount of focus on what we need to do, which is to save the next generation from an epidemic of AIDS. Thank you again, Sharon, for being here with us tonight. My honor. It's always great to be here. The show was better than ever, I thought. How is this? There must be a secret because this is your third time at the Live Ball in Vienna. Is there a secret? Well, I'm very glad to be here. And you know, as long as there are people living with AIDS, we have to keep working till we find a cure and a vaccine. Too late. Patricia, um, I guess it must be a kind of uh, El Dorado paradise for you to be here. I've been here before. I love it here. The whole spectacle of it, the party of it, it's the biggest thing I've ever seen for AIDS. Uh, Gary, he's just a dream. the designer um, from Agent Provocateur. It was a crazy show on stage. We have been satisfied with it. Are you uh, good with it? It was like organized chaos backstage, but it was kind of great, you know, and I think that's what we expected. But no, I was really pleased with everything. But the girls were fantastic, you know. It's like the love force. It was fantastic, brilliant. Eve, next to me, we've got a very uh, special fashion uh, collection out as well called Fetish. Yes. Why? What's the name about? Well, you know, it's not what you think. It's not like Agent Provocateur. But uh, Asian Provocateur looks good under fetish. Um, but it's it's like shirts and jeans and beautiful dresses. It's definitely for a girl who's fashion forward. Alan Cumming, it's a pleasure to have you back again here. Thank you, Alphine. It's very nice to be back. Last year, your husband was here last year. Where is he tonight? Who's a heart He's over there. He's and he's very shy, right? That's what you said. Yeah, he's a bit shy to do interviews. Yeah. You know why last year when you said, can we do an interview together? And, and I was like, not really. And you said you'll be the first ever same-sex married couple ever on Austrian television. We were like, okay. Last question, what did you think about this beautiful bunch of girls, naked girls on stage? I was about to hand my gay card back. <laughs> I think a lot of Austrians will think like you right now. Thank you for your humor. Alan Cummings, Hollywood Star. Ten feet off the ground I'm hearing what you say But I just can't make a sound 